challenge and all these things you get me but you don't know we have to do some cooking right we have to do some cooking now right yeah man so listen we have a one pop wonder for you today you get me see i was in woolwich today i come out of the studio and i was passing down baker and i see one, one little store there one rasta man selling some fruit and vegetables and thing and he had a one pot right and in that pot is everything you need pretty much to make the soup what we're gonna make today. So today, people, cook and fire, we're making chicken soup. Jamaican style chicken soup. You know what I'm saying? Cause you know all the things that are ready. So yeah, it's a one pot thing and you just give it a thing and say, yeah, nice me up and he even bless me up and give me a free cho-cho to put in it. So yeah, let me, uh, let me get started, people, you know, and let me show you the ingredients that we're gonna put in the one pot wonder Jamaican soup today with Ender Art oh, cooking by Big Up Moss Media. You done no man like see on the camera. It's a family thing. Big Up Baker. You know me. Big Up DBP Apparel. You know what I'm saying? For the jumper. Appreciate that. Even though I got it wet before I even started washing up the pot. But. Yee, yee, you know me. Hey, anyway, people, ingredients today, yeah? We have chicken. I want a little pack of chicken. We get, can we forget to buy chicken, sir? So see, buy chicken, and this are the only chicken in fine. That was the oh, only chicken in the shop, but. Only chicken in their shop? No, but it no matter, because we just need, we don't need too much chicken, because right now, the most important thing in this recipe, see, is the vegetables. You understand, because that's the goodness and the things that you want to eat this time of year because it's, it's very freezing outside if you're in England. So you don't know these things are going to warm you up and make it good and nice. You understand? So first of all, chicken. Yeah? Yam. We have some yam. We have a cho-cho. Some people call it Christophine. All right? We have two carrots. We have five okra. We have two cocoa, right? Some people call them different things, but um, yeah, I'm pretty sure them call them cocoa. Kind of like a potato kind of thing, you know? We have one green banana, you know what I'm saying? We have some chicken noodle soup mix. We have some chicken seasoning, and we have some all-purpose seasoning. And we have one scotch bunny. I don't know if I said that already. <laughs> But yeah, and some time, you know what I mean? Cause it's about time you said the time. Baker's in the background throwing his fingers around like I forgot something. So I don't know what I forgot. The pumpkin. The what? Pumpkin. The pumpkin. Come on, bro. <laughs> Baker. You know what I mean? <laughs> People, the pumpkin. All right. The pumpkin is really important as well. So I really should have said that first. But yeah, that's all the ingredients. So um. We're gonna get a list of the ingredients right here anyway. The side. Yeah, man. So first of all, people, yeah, how we're gonna start this soup is we're just gonna put the chicken in a pot, right? With some boiling water. Good piece of water, because you know we're making a soup. You know what I'm saying? 
So we're gonna put the chicken in and then we're gonna put the pumpkin in. Just these two things at the moment, right? We're not gonna put any seasoning and we're not gonna put anything else in at the moment. Right now, we're just gonna put the chicken and the pumpkin. Do you know what? And I'm gonna put the thyme in as well. I'm gonna put a little bit of thyme in. So yeah, I'm gonna cut up the pumpkin, chop the chicken in, little bit of thyme, soon forward. All right then. So we have the chicken and the pumpkin inside. So basically the pumpkin, I got to build up the flavor. You, you see me see, the pumpkin, I got to build up the flavor in the water. So all this little skimmy little piece, you want to get rid of this. All uh, this little piece here, man. You get me, but yeah. And just the more you stir it and keep that going. So yeah, we're just going to leave this now for about... 25 minutes yeah we're gonna leave this for about 25 minutes and let the pumpkin get nice and soft and then like go into the water and build up like the consistency and a little flavor so right now just chicken and the pumpkin are going in at the pot and Zima said yeah man cook and vibe a long time when I cook no food in the kitchen man but we there man yeah man so you don't know people, may I go and cut up the vegetables, you get me? Yeah, you see it right there, I've cut up the yam. I've cut up one cocoa. I'm just cutting up that now. The other one, sorry. Yeah, you get me? I'm gonna cut up the cho-cho afterwards. And the carrot. There's me. Right, people, yo! You don't know, it's coming up to Christmas time. Yeah? Can we just get some likes? Just cause, just for the seasonal spirit, please. Can we just get some likes? You know what I mean? Yeah, but the Christmas time's coming up. You don't know. we got some things. We have to do some Christmas, you know, episodes for Cook and Vibe. Do you know what I'm saying? So we're going to do a Christmas roast dinner. Yeah, we're going to do a Christmas roast dinner. And we got some sorrow as well. So just watch out for the Christmas episodes. You don't know. Make sure you subscribe, like. Comment, share, you don't know, tell a friend to tell a friend. It's Cook and Vibe, man. The only cooking show you need to be watching in the UK. Every Sunday, 6.30. And you don't miss it. You know how the thing goes already. What do we say? Why I? <laughs> yeah, man. Some people call it Christophine, yeah? But Cho-Cho, innit? That's all I know the name for in Jamaica, innit? Cho-Cho. But yeah, man. I go and cut it up now. This... <laughs> Yo, people, if you've seen the hot wing challenge, I've been through some stuff in the past few weeks. Wow, bruv. Wow, that spice was something different, you know, see. Honestly, I never, ever, ever, ever in my life experienced spice like that. Oh, my God. But, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed it and had a good laugh at me. You know what I'm saying? But no, you get me, it was a good, it was it was fun, it was fun, like afterwards, like watching the episode was fun, but believe me, at the time it wasn't fun. Yeah, not enough fun about that. So yeah, um, what else have we got to talk about? Drip Like Water, yeah, Drip Like Water, the new single, that's out now, if you haven't checked that out, go check that out on Link Up TV. Can we get a little clip of that running, please? Yeah. Um, so we're just acting, man. I'm trying to get some new music for Christmas. I've got a couple new tunes to drop for call before basically blah 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 before Christmas. You know what I'm saying? So um, just please subscribe so you don't miss nothing, people, because we're out here and we're going to be doing some fun stuff over the Christmas time. Do you know what I'm saying? We've got loads of plans. So um, before I cut, all right. So I'm going to cut up this. Cho cho, and then we're gonna check on the pot and see what I go on in the pot. Yeah, baby. Yeah, cause you have to tell them everything in a bitch in the car. You know what I'm trying to do right now. <clears throat> With Cook and Vibe, I don't want it to just be some big vibes comedy thing. And I know a lot of that's been like that recently. Do you know what I'm saying? Because this is about cooking and it is about, you know, 
telling people how to cook. Do you know what I'm saying? And you know what I mean? This is a proper meal. You know what I'm saying? If you want to get all the, the stuff to make this, you know where to go and get it. Brixton, anywhere like this, you, you know. If you live in England, you know where to get these places. If you're in Jamaica, then it's a simple thing. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we're good just. Shout out to all the carrot, they really. Be able to man. You get me, see? I'm gonna wash off that one there, but this one here, wash this one already. Just cut off this one. You know what, yeah? I don't even usually put carrot in my chicken soup. But yeah, like I said, I was just in Woolwich today. I was going through the market. I don't know, we had to cook something to cook and buy it. The rest of man had a one pot. And I was actually gonna cook some brown stew chicken, yeah? But I see the one pot of chicken soup and I said, that's the one baker. That's the one you needed. You know what I mean? You know I mean? This time of year, soup. Do you know what I'm saying? And, and most of the time in Jamaica, you'll eat this for breakfast. This is a breakfast thing. Yes, yeah, about 12 o'clock at night. <laughs> That's how we do things at Cook and Vibe. It's a mad thing, but this is the thing that we do to keep giving you episodes. We are so close to 10K, people, oh man. Yum green banana and soup. Don't let that go over your head. Anyway, yeah, <laughs> we're gonna cut up the green banana now, yeah? Now, Put a slice down there. Now let's see. You didn't be. You not. I mean, <laughs> it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, just gonna peel the green banana. And just one finger is good enough, you know. You see how out? There's not even. It's not even like a wally of everything going in this. It's just like, you know what I mean? Little bit, little bit, little bit. You see me bacon, it kind of like, it builds it up nicely. Yeah, so you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, keep it warm, man. Yeah, yeah. Keep you warm, man. Green banana. You know what I'm saying? So that is all the vegetables cut up right now, people. You see it there, see? One plate of goodness, you know? Yeah, yam, green banana, carrot, okra, cho-cho, cocoa. Yeah, man. So right now, as soon as with this, as soon as the the pumpkin has given enough flavour into the chicken, you get me. We're gonna season with a little bit of chicken seasoning and some all-purpose seasoning, right? And we're gonna put something in that I haven't even said yet. <laughs> An onion, yeah, because we need to put, you should use scallion, right? But I don't actually have any. Rasta, you should have put the scallion in at the pattern. And the chow, see, I'm, I'm supposed to put the scallion in the pot, man. Yeah, 100. But we got the rasta kind, of giving the free chow chow, so. We can't complain, we have to give thanks in our life, you know what I'm saying? Manners and respect every time. Yeah, so people, let's go let, let's go check out the pot and see how it's looking. We're gonna see what I've got. Yeah man! So you don't know people, I don't want to overpower this with too much seasoning. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to overpower it, it's too much seasoning. Oh, you see these little things in Jamaica, see? Mm. Like a seasoning in them. Yeah. Yeah, man, do you know what I mean? Chief Yeah, so nice. Point. I'm telling you, yo, we got the rest of man in Woolwich. I'm going to big you up. Next time we're there, man, we're going to bring the camera. Yeah, so I'm just going to add one of these little sachets of chicken seasoning. One little sachet. All purpose seasoning, you don't know we use the real thing, man. 
And I'm just gonna put a little bit of that. Look and learn, look and learn, people. You don't know anything. Set cook and vibe, we know the measurements. Little piece. You know what I'm saying, see? Yeah, man, we don't wanna overpower it. So, like I said, should have scallion, but we're just gonna use an onion the same way. You see me baker because the, the chicken, I don't mind chicken skin when it's barbecued or it's grilled or something like that, but you know it's in a soup. You don't you know I'm a slimy, slimy sitting in there. You know what I'm saying? See. Alright. Now with the scotch bonnet now, I'm not even gonna add it yet. Right? I'm not gonna add it yet because kids them is gonna eat. I don't want to make it too spicy. So right now I'm going to leave this for like another... Why am I going to leave this for like another... 25 minutes. Yeah man, I'm going to leave for like 25 minutes. And then... Now we're going to add the scotch bonnet before then. In about 10 minutes or so I'm going to add the scotch bonnet. But I'm going to leave this for another 25 minutes, right? Then we have to add the chicken noodle soup mix and bing bang bosh. That's the soup. Yeah! Why I? So we're gonna add the scotch bonnet now, people. You get me? I'm gonna dash that in there like that simple. And now what I'm gonna do here yeah, is I'm gonna get the chicken, see, and I'm gonna take off the take off the um, skin off of it, not just take it off like that, but yeah. Get this and I just mash up the chicken in it, little piece, you know what I'm saying, so the chicken breaks up a bit. Start doing that for now, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, people, we're gonna do this for another 10 minutes. Like I say, I've already give you the timing, so just work it out and do the you know what I'm saying? But yeah, we soon forward. Finished. You know what I'm saying? You see how the chicken just falling off now, see? You get me? Ready up. Ready to plate it up, you know what I'm saying? So let's plate it up and and do the tasting, you get me? Yeah man. Yeah, 
mean, cook and vibe? Listen, we're going to do a lot of cooking for the next few episodes. So don't worry yourself. You get me? We've got a Mexican episode. Yo, that one's going to be cold. Trust me. So watch out for that one. So they don't know the chicken salt ready. You know what I'm saying, Baker? Man, yep. we've been chilling for time. It's about one o'clock in the morning again. We're cooking breakfast food at one o'clock in the morning again. But you don't know, in the pot, when the little one wakes up in the morning, there's some good food for her with a lot of, you know what I'm saying? Jokes aside, baby, yeah. there's a lot of good vegetables and stuff in that for her. So she's good for the morning. Do you know what I'm saying? So taste time. Now there's Wally things in here that obviously we can taste, but you don't know me, I go for the green banana. And Zimmy Bacar, strong backer. Proper, man. Proper, and that's what I'm saying. Remember, that's a big pot, you know. A big pot. And I didn't put a lot of seasoning in it. All the, all the vegetables and the, the onion, the thyme and everything, the pumpkin and everything builds up the flavour, people. You see me? So you don't know, man, just... Keep subscribing, liking, sharing, telling your people Cook and Vibe is the only cooking show in the UK you don't know editing set. I'm proper trying to give some energy here, people, but I'm mad tired, you know. I am mad tired. Let me taste some of this chicken coming. Hungry, everyone. What can I have to say? Chicken soup. Cook and Vibe. He's been man like C. He was man like Baker. I was M da R. And I still am M da R. And this was cooking fine. What are we? <laughs> Yeah, I'll ask it.